We have to get ready. You get ready for what? You think that Jason Bourne was the whole story? There's a lot more going on here. What the hell don't I know about this? All right, let's roll, please. Action! The audiences love this franchise, so it's pretty exciting to take on such a responsibility. It's a complete offshoot from the trilogy that came before. Find him fast and kill him. We wanted to create a larger conspiracy. The Treadstone program that you saw was only one program. Jason Bourne isn't the only agent that's out there. Who the hell is he? He's an outcome agent. It's Aaron Cross. We have never seen evaluations like this. You can't really control these agents, and they're too smart. You had alterations made to two different chromosomes. Muscle efficiency, pain suppression. It's the most exciting development in the history of the science. Well, I'm not just a science project, Doc. People, listen up. This story is taking place at the same exact time as the last movie took place. Jason Bourne is in Manhattan. Confirmed. What? This is a national security emergency. What happened at the end of Ultimatum, it's gone public. And that's created this ripple effect for these other programs. The FBI is investigating links between Treadstone and this man, Jason Bourne. Fear creeps in pretty easily. He becomes victim of politics at a higher level. You start to consider the magnitude of what we're facing if this moves sideways on us. Meaning what? Meaning we will burn the program to the ground. Buyer is able to justify certain actions. Where are we? 30 seconds. Because of a larger morality that he believes in. Target destroyed. Aaron needs Marta to survive. And they're trying to kill her as well. Hey, look, look. It's me. Do you want to live? Do you want to live? Yes. Good. There really is no one else to turn to. It. They end up completely relying on one another. We have less than eight minutes to clear out of here. It's the next thing coming through that door. It's gonna wipe us out. They're not dead? I thought they were dead. It's run and gun from that point on. The Bourne legacy is raw, exciting, dangerous, edgy, sexy. And the stakes really don't get any higher. You should have left me alone. And then this fight to survive, there's a lot of action. It is high octane. Ah! 